Cowboys running back Tony Pollard reportedly tore his plantar fascia on the long touchdown run in week 13. He played sparingly after that. Now comes a report that he tore his plantar fascia. This is actually not the worst news in the world, and here is why. Admittedly, you never want to tear anything. However, the plantar fascia is a cord-like structure along the base of the foot, along the arch. And structurally, it doesn't have significant functional significance. It's more of a pain tolerance issue. Yes, you can flatten your arch a little bit if you tear your plantar fascia, but it's a pain tolerance issue mostly. If it's partially torn and it continues to micro tear, that is prolonged pain. For example, for example, that is what Taysom Hill had and when he missed a bunch of time. The fact that Pollard tore his might be good news in that it actually self-fixes the problem as soon as the swelling goes down. It does make sense that he's been out of practice the last couple of days, but that doesn't rule him out for this week. You can take a pain-killing injection to try and play through. We'll see if that's the case for Pollard. The Cowboys certainly have some need for Pollard given uh, Ezekiel Elliott's continuing knee contusion issues. Well, always trying to be on the bright side. This is why a tear of the plantar fascia isn't always the worst news in the world. Hopefully Tony can play through and the Cowboys can keep rolling forward. Thanks for watching. This is Dr. David Chow, ProFootballDoc.com. Subscribe at the YouTube channel here.